Aloha! Welcome back to our space station. My name is Tiki C. For this series, I'm looking for player-made space bases or capital vessels that I can convert into points of interest or orbital patrol vessels. As of today, there are over 121,000 Steam Workshop blueprints for Empyrean. I have converted 123. We need more POIs and ships in the game. Let's convert them. More conversions means more variety in the game, which means more fun for us. The conversion rules are right here, so feel free to pause and take a look. Let's get started. I have searched through the most popular blueprints of all time on the Steam Workshop, and I found one to convert today. Conversions are being done in a slightly modified vanilla creative game, so converted blueprints should be universally compatible with scenarios. You will see a time-lapse video as I take a quick tour of each, add or remove devices and blocks, save, and celebrate. Today, I will convert the HSS Endurance by J.H. Elfnessa. This is a cool looking base that will be converted into a hostile point of interest and then submitted to Elyon for review. We also have a guest appearance on the conversion crew today, the BHZ Gunstar 1 RE by Drama Proof. I've been dreaming about flying a Gunstar since I was a kid to defend the frontier against Zur and the Kodan Armada. Links to these blueprints can be found in the description below. Thank you to all of the authors for their artistic works and their contributions to the community. A special thank you goes out to Elyon for the Empyrean Galactic Survival Game. And to all of the scenario designers and content creators, thank you for creating new ways for all of us to enjoy this game. Are you ready? Here we go.
Okay, I think I'm done with this one. I had to do some work off camera. Some of the uh, texturing was messed up from uh, when I replaced the block, so I had to fix that. I also had to do something with these sides. There was a, an open space here, so I just did a uh, entryway on both sides there. Uh, what else did I do? I had to flesh out some of the areas to support the NPCs, so you'll see bunk beds and bathrooms and some common areas just to make it look like it's been lived in. I also fleshed out this area here with some, uh, some more bathrooms and bunk beds just to give it that lived in feel for all the NPCs that I added to it so it looks like a functional base. So let's take a look at this on the quality assurance server and see how it works. That was fun. <laughs> there are a few things I gotta fix before I submit it to Elyon, but it's pretty much done. So I appreciate the opportunity to convert that. Thank you, JH Elfnessa. And we're done. Thank you so much for joining me today. I look forward to talking to you again soon. Have a great day.